Hi everyone, it's Lonnie. Welcome back to Grace Blossoms for You. Today I want to make a few pockets and do a couple of pages. So um, let's get started. So I have already made a couple of pockets that I want to put in. I just got to find the page. Oh, this was one of them. So maybe I'll start with this one. And then the pocket I wanted to put here is just a coffee dyed cardstock simple pocket. But what I want to do is put some fabric or something on here. So let's see how this goes. I'm going to get my hot glue going there. So this is going to be a side loading pocket. I got a new uh, phone with a new camera obviously so I am hoping to stay in frame today. It looks like it's a little bit different from my last one. All right, so I want this about almost to the seam there. And then the fabric, I stamped an image on some fabric. So I want that to be roughly there. I was wondering if I should put like another layer behind it to make it stand out or maybe some, I don't know, maybe some darker lace. But let me tack it down with, with some hot glue just to see if I want to actually do that. I just wanted to kind of put it in the corners there. And then I wanted this lady on here. She has some sewing on her too. I was hoping to put her in that corner there. This is the one where I put the tea bag over and then just sewed around the edge. So there's that. Now I could bring her down a little bit, I suppose, just to keep the whole thing off center. Or I could, hmm, maybe I want to do something like that. Because she's a little bit long for this spot. So if I bring her down and then fold that up, I can make a little bit of a tuck there. But I want more of her neck showing. Okay, so a smaller tuck, something like that maybe. And then oh, it's got fabric, or yeah, it's got thread on it, so I'll just do that so it stays. Would be nice if um, glue stayed where you put it. Okay, so then there's that. 
I'm just gonna ink that a bit more. Something like that. And then I seem to have an issue with the glue today. Deciding which one to use. Okay. Then I thought some buttons. These aren't the prettiest buttons, but I have so many of them. And yellow and purple kind of go together, right? So there's that. Maybe pearls would have been better. I just thought of that. All right. So then, yes, I think I need some color over here. So maybe some lace, maybe just fabric. It's kind of hard to know. I think I need to Cut some smaller pieces, just maybe to tuck behind there. I found a blouse that was too small, so I decided to sacrifice it. okay if it sticks out there and if it sticks out there a little bit yeah I think I'm gonna do that Anyways, that just kind of sticks out there and it's a piece of fabric and there's another piece of fabric and I think I'm going to call that good. All right, so then the next one had a really colorful, there we go. Oh look, I did mark it. Okay, so what I want to do on this one is put that lace down on the edge. And then I have a couple of options. I was thinking um, the leaves I coffee dyed or coffee painted with coffee the other day. Um, I was thinking either that one or this strip. And then the pocket I want to put in here is a pocket that I painted on and I used, um, tracing paper and I just doubled it up for thickness and um, just cut a pocket shape. So I was thinking of putting that here. 
And it's okay if it goes on the strip a little bit. Like that. Or do I like this better? I think actually if I used that leaf, then I would go on the outside of it like so on top here. Just on the very edge because I want to leave that pocket mostly open. So I think I'm going to do that. So I hope you are doing well today. It's been a rough patch for a lot of people lately. We've been okay. My son is getting ready to go back to school. He's doing the online courses right now. He wants to go back to in-person school, but I think that'll have to wait till next year if we're still here. I just don't like all the garbage that they're putting on kids in school these days. He can, he can learn garbage anywhere. Doesn't need to go to school for that. Of course, I would rather he didn't learn all the garbage. All right, so there's the pocket. There's the side. And then need something here. Maybe a label. Now I have so many labels, I really need to reorganize them. Um, yeah. Here's one from the uh, ones I did. Don't really like that there. Here's some botanical labels that I got free from Seven Plaza. And that's Margaret. Very generous of her to share her her digital, some of them. Um, I don't know, is it too long? Do I need something? I need something roundish. I like how the green pops there. Let's see. I still have all these round thingies too. Maybe a clock. The reason I say that is because across over here is a clock in the background. And so that's something shiny and it breaks up the color a bit. Maybe a word strip. How about you make me smile? I like that. That about there. And then this one, kind of around it. That way it catches, catches everything, the lace, the side, the pocket, and the word strip. There we go, like that. Alright, so that's two pages done for today. I think that's a good a good thing. Um, now I need some verses. 
We need some verses to put in there. And I need to close my glue so it doesn't dry out. If you're looking for a pin for your glue bottles that doesn't rust, um, I got some on Amazon. They're actually for wigs and whatnot. But problem solved. And then uh, now I have extras because they came in a package. All right, so a little tip there because I didn't know what to put in there because the ones I had were rusting, so. All right, there's that. I'm just gonna do a few verses today because I haven't done any for a bit. I actually made a video with the verse the other day and it didn't turn out, so um, it's been a little bit. All right. Let's go back to this lady here because I see a small. Oh, that's too big. Well, we can put a little ticket in there. How about that? Okay. I picked this as a journal card because it has the music on it. And then I thought of the song, Praise God, From Whom All Blessings Flow. And so then I wrote my verses on here. Romans 14, verses 17 to 19. For the kingdom of God is not eating and drinking, but righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Spirit. For he who in this way serves Christ is acceptable to God and approved by men. So then we pursue the things which make for peace and the building up of one another. So I think there's something in there to be said for um, how we serve. Because the Bible says to do all things for him. Okay, so that's a little small. Hmm. Even if I, I could probably make it narrower to make it fit, but I'm just going to put that in a different spot and then I will pick something smaller for this pocket. This is a nice picture. I think I got this from Graphics Fairy. Now may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing so that you will abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. So that was Romans 15, verse 13. And then it says, Now the God of peace be with you all. Amen. And that's Romans 15, verse 33. So that should definitely have room in here. There we go. And maybe this one will have room in this one here. Well, it would if I hadn't cut that off there or covered that up. Let's see. We find a good hiding spot for this one. Well, I guess I'm going to have to start writing smaller verses. Or using smaller paper to write my verses on. Here we go. Nice big pocket there. And then that can go up a little so it looks like there's something there. And let's see, where was I? I had. Why is it so hard to find your spot? Does anybody else have that issue or is it just me? Okay, I bought that one. And then I had the other. 
There we go. All right, so I need like a skinnier for this one. How about my parrot? Will he fit in here? Oh, that's kind of cool. I can still see this tracing paper so it's kind of um, translucent there. What I'm going to do with this one since I have not inked it yet, I'm just going to trim the, the sides of it. And round my corners. I can't see much, but I can see a little bit of it. Okay. Just gonna ink this a little. And then the parrot can live in here. But the humble will inherit the land and will delight themselves in abundant prosperity. Mark the blameless man and behold the upright, for the man of peace will have a posterity. Psalm 37 verses 11 and verse 37. Okay, so this pocket came undone. I may not like the hot glue, I'm not sure. I'll try that. And in fact, if you double up something, you have to close it off too because I forgot to attach the um, tracing paper to itself. There we go. That'll be better. He can poke his little head out there so he can say hi. All right, that's what I got for you today, and um, I hope that you're blessed in every way. And we'll see you again next time. Bye for now.